Hey, what's going on, Larry gang? It is currently 2 a.m., hence why I look like a total piece of garbage. But I'm going to be watching a little mini series I'd made when I was little. It is pretty cringy. It was made 10 years ago. Enjoy. So, this video here was our take on making a Nerf video. Do you remember that, like, uh, those old school Nerf videos, how people get, like, an arsenal of Nerf weapons and they'd run around, make a shooting video, and, like, it would either have special effects or it'd just be really, really well filmed. We decided to have a go at that. Can't remember what we filmed it on, but the camera at the time was actually pretty decent. Um, it was a digital camera. You'll see the quality of it. It was actually pretty good. We had a group of friends in the street, about eight kids total, and we'd run around, play together, and make dumb videos like this. I had just learned how to use iMovie when I made this video. I had edited it myself. Um, I, just, I was quite proud of it. Like, I actually filmed and edited it myself, but I also acted in it a bit as well. So you're going to see some, some of my childhood acting. <laughs> so we wanted him to fall down, but we didn't want him to hurt himself. So he kind of just flopped on the trampoline. We didn't have anything called a stunt double. And also, uh, yeah, the cuts are really strange here, obviously, because it was, I think, 11-year-old me nine years ago. So the guy up there, he's my little brother, and he wanted to star as the main character in the video. That's our dog. We still have him. He's actually in the house right now. Uh, I actually fast forwarded this because my brother took too long to jump over the fence and it didn't look cool. So I fast forwarded the video to make it look like that's me. Hey, I was the, I was the clean sniper. It's going in there for shots. <laughs> and look, look at this cut. Look at this cut. <laughs> oh my gosh, that acting though. And then I went to go check to see if my brother had died and then he shot me. I forgot we're bad actors. And then the guy that died earlier on the trampoline is suddenly alive again. What is this plot development? My brother had this thing where he was smiling the entire time, even when under fire and being interrogated. He is a psycho in this film. The first bit of dialogue. There is a tango on your six, I repeat. Tango on your six. Now this part here. So my mum was just minding her own business. She didn't know we were doing this. And my brother just walked up to her and threatened her, asking her where the money was. My mum, as lovely as she is, she actually suddenly acted it out and played along with it. So, you know, but she didn't move from a seat and just stayed typing on a laptop. Okay, woman, I don't have day. Where's the money? Oh, no. it's <laughs> my brother's like, Where's the money? And she's like, I don't know. And then he goes, like, exactly like this. Like, seriously. And he starts, like, laughing while pointing a gun at my mom. Oh, my lord. Oh, we've got a sneaky ninja coming in. Oh, is that a cliffhanger I see? Should I watch the next episode? <laughs> we recorded this like a week after, so they're wearing different clothes. <laughs> oh, that that music changed halfway through a scene. It's a sad moment. He's being captured. Look, look at him. Look at my brother. Look, he's smiling the whole time. We kept telling him stop smiling, but in the end we gave up because he just wouldn't stop. Look at him. In comes the savior of the day. Now, funny thing is he actually did hit that kid in the head. Uh, there was a bit of crying after that. You can see like the Lego I had in the corner and like my soccer trophies in, on the shelves. I love how they're just running past my mom. My mom was very good natured. Sniper's coming in. Is he gonna kill? He shot up dead shot. Checking to see if he's dead. He's dead. Oh, but he's got to check again. Breach and clear situation. Look at the psychopath! Look at him! He knows he's about to go kill a bunch of guys, and he's happy about it. Have I not seen that? Look, look at this. Look at the background. By the way, that gun that he's holding, this gun here, was my favorite Nerf gun, and it disappeared. Lost it. I don't, I don't know where it went. I honestly think one of the kids in the street stole it, and then I never saw it again. <laughs> it was really good. It cost me 120 bucks. It was a lot of money. <laughs> Pretty sure these guys each collectively have been killed like three times. We made a third episode, by the way. 
<laughs> okay, so this is when my editing had gotten a little bit better because I was actually teaching myself After Effects. I didn't use any After Effects in this video, but it was better because I was gradually learning different editing skills that came with learning After Effects. This is still 10 years old, this video. <laughs> Oh, by the way, our acting was a little bit better as well here because we kind of got really into it. Except that part then. Forget you saw that. Oh, yeah, this is me. I was wearing two shirts on because we thought it would make me look different as a character because I show up multiple times. We're getting the army up. Look at our arsenal. We had an arsenal. Oh, this scene here was sick. I was so proud of this at the time. <laughs> oh, as, as well edited that uh, that was for the time of me editing that. That is still very cringy. Oh yeah, and the operating table for the surgery was a bed. Remember the kid that died in the first episode of this? He makes a, an amazing return. I'm back, baby! Wearing the sunglasses. <laughs> Just mows down them all. Man, we had so much fun filming these. Maybe in the future, I'll try and recreate, like, the Nerf Estate Takedown series. But with, like, the video editing and film making knowledge that I have now. I might actually do that. I think that'd be a lot of fun. I'd have to gather a bunch of, like, people, though. To re I wonder if I could, like, get in contact with these kids to, like, remake it. That'd be cool. I was the hacker. I was the man in the chair. Oh, by the way, I uh, knew a little bit of like notepad. I knew a little bit of uh, command prompt coding when I was little. My dog just pissed on my seat. Did she actually? Just a little bit. Oh. Just a little bit. Just enough for some fresh content on the Larry channel. I'm actually looking like real Hi. software hacking scene you see in the movies. Coming in to make sure the microchip doesn't get found out and then destroys the microchip. Hey, oh, the chip's been destroyed. I'm on my way. Good job, mission accomplished. Good job, mission accomplished. Now to escape. Oh, they're getting ambushed. Getting shot out gradually one by one. Oh, this was sick. Okay, so we're on a hill here. He actually jumped backwards onto a hill. He really hurt himself doing this, but it looked cool. It was a shame I didn't have the camera pointed down a little bit more because it was actually really cool. Just like, just watch what happens. That, that, was, that was the best acting out of the whole thing. He really hurt himself in the process, but it did make for a pretty sick scene. Yeah, I don't know how that was the end. I kind of felt like we left a lot of, like, tales left unsolved. I think that's enough for one video for today. Thanks for watching guys and uh, I'll, I'll make some more of these like I watch my cringy. I'll make some more of these videos of I watch my cringy stuff from the past because uh, it's actually quite fun watching them and I have a lot of cringy stuff to show. Oh my god. How's it going guys? You might be asking who even am I and why am I even here? But I uh, just want to let you know, I'm Larry's editor and I'm here for a little bonus clip to show you guys. When I was editing the introduction of this video or just this video in general, I noticed a little glitch in the audio. I'm going to play you guys the introduction of this video again, but this time with the glitched audio. Here it is. Again, it is currently 2 a.m. Hence why I look like a total piece of garbage. But I'm going to be watching a little mini series I made when I was little. It's